You know, it is great to be at Stan Stock. I know this is the third one, and it's great for a lot of reasons. First of all, it brings people together. A lot of the folks who grew up in Baltimore with all these great bands, uh, especially Rob Fahey, the original Ravens. I mean, there's so many great groups, but the main thing is we come together for charity. It feels awesome to be here today. Stan Stock is, it's an incredible gathering of musicians, of basically the whole musical family of Baltimore gets together to support some very, very worthy causes. event, meaning all of these Baltimore-based fans get to come together and basically have one big fun musical reunion, and 100.7 The Bay loves to be a part of that. because he had the idea of uh, going off of his Facebook page of the Baltimore bands from the 70s, 80s, 90s, and today to bring together all of these bands that are on this page for a big reunion and then to make it for a charitable purpose. I want to bring all the guys together like Stan Gibson envisioned three years ago, and it has just blossomed into this marvelous, you know, atmosphere, more of a community reunion of the players and the musicians from five decades. It's called the Catch Lift Fun. We are founded in 2010 after the death of Chris, uh, Corporal Christopher Coughlin in Afghanistan. And the mission of our organization is to provide gym memberships and in-home gym equipment to post 9-11 combat wounded veterans in an effort to help them recover, rehabilitate, and reintegrate through physical fitness. We also give a majority of our funds that we make on these occasions to the Nicole Van Horn Foundation with Vance and Nancy Van Horn, who lost their daughter uh, over a decade ago, just 12 years old. And that's why we work for no pay. And the musicians are here, no pay. It's all giving of their time, which you don't hear a whole lot about, because we're in it for the money, it wouldn't matter what they say. Brought together by Stan Gibson, it was a dream of his that we've made happen now for three years running. Local music, Baltimore music, we want to give them a place where the best can come out and perform for the people of Baltimore and raise money for charity. Specifically this year, we're supporting the uh, uh, Nicole Van Horn Foundation for Children's Cancer Research at Johns Hopkins Pediatric Hospital. Help me. Ravens race to 82, and we meet here at McAvoy's. We are big Ravens fans, but we also do a lot of charity work, um, and we have a lot of local charities in the Parkville area. Our main charity is Maryland School for the Blind, and we also um, do fundraisers for the local churches, St. John's, St. Ursula's. For all those reasons, Stan Stock is a major event. It's a great event. Stan Gibson helped start it, or start it all. And it works out great. This is the third year that we're doing it. 
Everybody comes together. It's a bigger event each year that it happens. All these magnificent high-end bands want to give to the overall, and that gives me joy. For more information about Stanstock and our charities, please check out these websites.